Is he? What? Okay, I'm in between two players, I think. Nope, that's a scab, but he's like shooting me through the wall. Oh, there he is. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of SPT Zero to Hero Tarkov with your host as always, Gamer Visuals. So guys, this episode is going to start a little bit differently and I'm just going to play some B-roll stuff right here. Uh, because I actually screwed up royally and uh, long story short, I had Discord open and I was in a chat you know, room, whatever. And uh, some people were chatting while I was recording. I had no idea that my Discord chat was still open. So while I was recording, there's some disembodied voices throughout my whole gameplay and stuff like that. So rather than putting you guys through that and making your ears bleed with whatever the hell they were talking about, uh, I'll just go ahead and give you the highlights of what should be episode 28. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and roll into episode 29 in this episode. So we're going to call this episode 28, uh, but this is actually just, just think of it as two episodes put together. So I'm going to give you the highlights of what happened in what should have been episode 28 right now. All right. First things first, we went to shoreline and tried to get shotgun kills uh, and we found the missing informant's body. So we did the cult one and got that done right here. And then we ended up running around trying to kill scavs. And in doing so, we ended up getting in a crazy firefight and the scavs actually ended up killing us because a giant scav army hoarded up and uh, yeah, shot me in the face, it, you know, head eyes once again. Uh, and then after that, uh, tried to go for another run of the same exact thing, went to the resort, and I got freaking head eyes by an AI PMC right through a window. Uh, yep, aim botted, dude. That uh, only way I can explain that one. And now the episode wasn't all bad because we then decided to switch things up and go to customs and man did I have some fun there. I decided to go ahead and start the Punisher, I think it's part 3 where you gotta use the AKS-74U and ran into the dorms area and lo and behold guess who was there? Rashala and the boys. So in this fight right here you can see that I am just spraying and praying right here. I mean I'm aiming down the side obviously but man uh, we actually did really really good here. I ended up just like putting really really uh, intense fire on these guys and in this this firefight, I didn't just kill Rashala and a guard this time, I ended up killing the entire pack of all of them. So that quest that I got before where I had to go in and kill uh, Rashala's guards, that is now completed because of this run right here. Uh, so we got all that loot, we got you know, Rashala's guards loot and uh, his loot once again. And this time he didn't have his golden TT and the, uh, the AK again. This time he actually was carrying the MDR loadout that he carries sometimes. So here's the last kill right here. Uh, go ahead and I go ahead and spray this dude down. And yeah, so we got a load of nice, uh, nice loot right here and just basically some money to spend so that's really it guys we we killed actually no sorry this is maybe the last guy right there so we got them all killed and uh, had a lot of fun doing it um, so yeah that's pretty much it you guys uh, from there let's go ahead and move on to the start of the next episode well the same episode like I said but kind of the next episode Hello everybody and welcome to another Escape from Tarkov video with SPT Zero to Hero Tarkov with your host as always gamer visuals guys we're back and what i think we're going to do for the start of this episode is we're going to go back to the dreaded interchange it has been really annoying for us um but we got to get a lot of scav kills and we got to get this um we got to get this quest line from mr uh mr ragman going because this is we, we got to complete this to open up more quests from him so uh, he's the only one that we've kind of been lagging behind on all of his stuff so we got to do this quest and uh, get get these scav kills. And while we're at it, we're gonna go in there. We're gonna loot some stuff because for the the hideout, we actually need to loot uh, power supply units. So I got a nice big backpack right here. Uh, a couple extra, actually, I don't know why that's there. That's probably from the last raid we were there. Um, a couple extra slots to also uh, carry more. And uh, we're gonna see how we do. So, without further ado, let's hop into the first raid. All right, you guys. So, where are we at here? Um, you know, am I right next to the little? Little camp over there where the car is. Am I is that right? Or am I am I not realizing where I'm at correctly? You know, I don't think I am actually. No, no, you know what? Okay. 
I'm in a different spot than I think I was, but that's okay. We're going to go right up here. And we're going to go right into the back of, uh, I think this is Goshen, if I'm not mistaken. Let's put this on full auto because I'm pretty sure we're going to have a... We normally every single time have an enemy PMC or something right here. Probably should have just gone underneath. We have an enemy PMC or we have a scab that spawns right here every single time. It's getting pretty bad when I'm doing this uh, map because I kind of am starting to memorize the spawns. Yeah, you hear that? That's him. Maybe I can... Right, that'd be nuts if I would've hit him. That'd be, that'd be fucking crazy, right? I'm gonna get shot in the back doing this. It might be, he might just be down here. I don't know. Delphi heard somebody though, so there's somebody in here. Or somebody up here. Obviously has the same idea as me. See if maybe they went. No. Nope. By the way, this up here, you can climb up there. It's a really good hiding spot. If you guys didn't know that, you can camp people that come out of here. It's pretty, pretty nice. All right. Yeah, I think this dude took off and ran. Whoever it was. All right. So we're gonna look for loot around in this area. And uh, kill scabs, obviously, because that's what we need too. But, um, yeah, we got a certain type of loot that we need as well, so. Oh, okay. Did he come through here? Why is this box open? Maybe he came through here. I think this sucks, because that was my only grenade that I threw. Forgot to pack another one. That's right, hopefully we'll loot another one or something. Main thing here... Just gotta make sure I freaking get in and get out of these raids, man. Okay, perfect. We're in the back of Ollie. Okay, cool. So I was wrong. It's not Goshen, it's Ollie that I'm at. Okay. If I was this dude, where would I go? Did he go this did he, I'm gonna try to see if I can follow. I'm gonna follow him. I'm gonna pretend I'm him. Ooh, did he go into the, the nice rooms? This is where I would have gone. I don't know if I'll end up needing those, but um, check all the computers here. Oh, I think we actually need those manuals for something soon, so might as well take them. I don't need caps, really. I just need power supplies. And watch, when I, I never really take them, but the second I actually need them, as usual, you're not going to find them. It happens every time. Isn't there, like, one more computer in here? What's this? <coughs> Oh, diary. Okay. Yeah, it really, I mean, really, these runs are going to straight straight just be loot and uh, and killing scav runs inside of interchange, so. Okay, we're going to go this way, actually. I want to go into Ollie. I think maybe he went that way. Could be wrong. He could have just gone straight, straight into Ollie, too. PSU? <laughs> I actually need that. And then the next level, the weapon rack. I kind of want to build a bigger... If if I'm not mistaken, right, this level 2 weapon rack actually makes it bigger. Don't know if I ever need propane right now. Yeah, see? I'm wondering where this guy went. Okay. Sometimes there's a stash back there, I think. At least it used to be. I'm going to take a second. Because this dude's probably running around through here. Is that unless he went the other way through Ollie? I don't know yet. Okay. So Ollie has been the area that I've died recently a lot in this map. And it's because I'm telling you, man, I'm 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 loot focused. I'm searching shelves, and I'm not. I don't think I'm uh, combat focused enough, and I and I need to be need to be more combat focused. I think. Those computers? No, it's not. So 
every time there's been scavs. See anybody? It's the famous last words, though. Is I don't see anyone. And there's like a million of them that just spawn in out of nowhere. Oh shit! See what I'm saying? He's right there. Literally, like, if I would've... Just go down the stairs? He did. This guy's right here. Do I just leave him alone? chase after him. Hmm. I want to kill going down this thing. Yeah, he's definitely down below. Alright. Kind of want to end this guy because I don't want to end up getting killed by him. I'm shooting. Great. I don't see anything. He's probably over there. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I kind of lost him. So I'm just going to run back up. Okay. Let's just keep our continue mission here. Okay, that lag right there usually means uh, scav spawning in. Hope they don't spawn like right on top of me, because you guys have seen in Shoreline that does happen. I don't think it's supposed to, but it does. All right, I'm gonna check the shelves, and stuff. Uh, what do you got here? Ammo, PRS, yuck. I hate these wide open areas like this. This is my least favorite about this area. There's cover and stuff, but man, it's just like the lanes you fight down are just wide open a lot. More propane. All right, I'm going to go in the back back here where these computers are. Yeah. I was hoping to find if there's a motor too. I would love, oh, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, here we go. Keck tape. It's always good to have. Shoot down this lane if I see him again. The dreaded place that I keep dying. No motors, nothing. Not right here anyway. Nails. I actually need those. Alright. Let's move this way. There's somebody down there. Is that in the back back here? Yeah, they might be in this back room here. PSU? argue with that either. Feels good. Okay. Thought I heard something. So let's continue. Uh, no computer in here, right? This is what I think this is a quest room. I want to say this guy probably came in here for the quest. Which I'm gonna have to do here pretty soon as well. Which that's why I have this key. Yeah, this is like a quest room. Clean. Man, not a single freaking one. Every time. Yep. Yeah. 
Every time the damn computers are just empty. Is he in here? Both em both open. Hmm. I wonder if he's like right here. Somebody running around down there. Yikes. Where? There he is. It's a player. I think he was fighting scavs. Uh-huh. He was down here taking my scav kills, man. Hmm. Well. There's probably scavs out this way, I would guess. But I guess I could continue in here. Uh, well, I'm kinda, yeah, I gotta go out to the other side of the map, don't I? So. I go loot him? Maybe we should go loot him first. Yeah, let's do that. That mannequin scared the shit out of me. Uh, bell combo. Those are kinda fun. Sometimes you can carry a lot of loot with them. A dead body? I think it is. I think he was... Was he fighting this guy? I wonder if he got in a fight with this guy and that's who, like, they killed each other. Probably. I would guess that's probably what happened. Yikes. Uh, what? Where? 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 Behind here? The fuck is he? I'm in between two players, I think. Nope, that's a scab, but he's like shooting me through the wall. Oh, there he is. What? Oh my god, the scabs on interchange are absolute chads, dude. Are you kidding me? Here we go again. What is going on? I, I don't get it. What? I don't, I, uh, what? Okay. I guess the only thing to do is to re-up and go again. I, this is, this is easily our worst map, everybody. I don't know why we keep getting wrecked on this map, but, uh, it seems like, did I get head jaws again? Uh, oh, hold on. Right to the head, right? What, what did he, where did he get me? He head jaws, see, I keep getting head shotted. Damn. Okay, well, I guess we gotta re-up and go again. Alright, everybody, here we go again. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, starting underneath the bridge here. I think we just hop right inside. Actually, there's a... There sometimes is a uh, hidden stash right here. No, let's just keep it on single for now. Watch, I'll do that and then I'll run right into a player or something. 
A lot of times they spawn right here. Is there a stash? Yes, there is. So let's see. If we get a player coming towards us. Oh, that's just me moving. Um, I think we just go in towards idea. Let's just go loot idea. That should be my idea for now. Okay. Hopefully I don't get shot in the back. Because somebody does spawn right there. I've spawned there many times. And then I run this exact route right here. Okay. Okay. Let's just... Let's just get in here. So it's so... So it seems, everyone... The scavs are uh, quite formidable right now. I'm putting this thing on full auto now since we're inside. Wait, did I just see? Uh, I thought I saw somebody run by there. We'll see. Here comes all the damn noise. I think somebody already ran in here. No? Alright. Can loot the room first, hopefully. Spark plugs. Need those. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna actually... Close both doors while I'm in here. So... Oh my. Okay. Fun. Well, that's some good money. Whether we get out of here or not. not too bad I'm not looking for CPU fans anymore. Okay, so I mean I'll put this up here. I'm gonna loot like all the tech spawns that I can. There's another, this, this one, and there's one. Okay. Let's go loot this room here. See if there's like a motor or something back here. Sometimes they can spawn in here. The only problem with being loot focused is you just gotta remember, you got to be ready to fight. Not too bad I'm not looking for CPU fans anymore, this would have been a good raid for that. Did I say that already? I think I did. Oh, another spark plug, wow. Okay. Good raid for spark plugs too. Shit. Okay, I don't want to go in the back of idea really, because... It can be an area where you can find... The loot I need, but really I want to go loot more computers. So I think um, going out through here. Going this way possibly. Might be our best bet, even though this is wide open to scabs, people, everything. I hate it. Although, there is lots of stuff to hide behind, though, if someone starts shooting at me. I just, this is the reason why I hate interchange, though. There's just so many, like, objects in front of you. Everything looks like a person. At least, to me. My eyes are just, like... Only you guys could see my, my damn eyes. Like, if I had a camera on my eyes while I'm playing this map. You guys would be like, what the hell is he looking at? It's because I'm scanning and looking, like, literally everywhere. Okay, we could go upstairs and go to, like, the the big tech store, too, actually, since we're here. Let's do that. Why not? We're by the staircase. We might as well do it. Hopefully Killa's not here. That would suck. Yeah, let's go up here and check it out. I 
at all. Uh, I think it's down at the other end, though. It's the problem. It's all right, though. Isn't this where it is? Yeah. Tech light, yeah. Am um, I missing loot spawns in here? Probably. Oh, shit. Heard somebody. Is that down there? No, I don't hear anybody. Of course. Yeah, I can't tell if like they're just gonna come around the corner on me or what. saving my life if I run out of ammo. You never know. Sometimes pistols, they do. Alright, we got a fight going on. That covers my sounds. Um, yeah, whatever I heard could have been right there. You know what's kind of fun to do? Stand right here so you can't get shot in the back. Snipe out these windows. See, look. Now we're talking, boys. Now, if I can catch this guy. Oh, there we go. Imagine I hit that. Got him. That's an easy way to kill scabs. We gotta do is just watch for things moving outside. Occasionally, there'll be a bunch of them running around, is that... Oh, dude, nice. You see them just like, I swear to God, man, they just look right at you. It's crap. Thought I have that no ESP thing on, but nah, man. That crap don't work. Those scabs look at you no matter what. Okay, I'm just scanning, scanning, scanning. I'm trying to look at the areas where I typically see him. I don't see any players. Oh, it's like knocking me off of this thing. There's a couple of nice, easy kills right there, so I'll take it. There's probably a lot more scabs over here since I saw that one. They're probably just hiding in there. So... Never a bad idea to kind of stand up here and... Oh, I see another one right there. No, that's like the tree or something. Man, I should, uh, you know what I should do for bolt action kills? I should come back to the same spot. If we somehow don't make it out of here, I should. That's yeah, happening over there. I should come back to this exact same spot and uh, bring a bolt action rifle. And get bolty kills. Even though this thing is... Oh, shit. Got him. I'm making a mess of these fools. It's 
That's why I see like I needed if I had a bolty right there, I would have I would have killed that guy so quick. Just one single shot. Okay, let's move. There you go. At least we got some kills this time. So even if we die, it's not a complete and total loss, you know? Also, this specific gun right here, I've used this. I haven't used it in a while. It's been sitting on the gun rack in the old uh, hideout, and I don't know, man. I like this gun. This specific AK just works. All right, let's load up our mags again. Keep it topped up. See, look, even with the, the FDE mag, the thing looks nice. Right, and then we're gonna go loot this tech store, and I think I'm just gonna go out the other side. Um, go find some computers. All right, got some action here. It's probably down. It's obviously. I think that's yeah. It's downstairs. There we go. What do we got? PCB. I'll take it. Yeah, I think it's downstairs for me. It's like 10k right there. Is it already been searched? Nope. Okay, what do we got? Taking, I'll just take everything. I don't care. It's money. Uh, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. I'm not going to say a word. A million gas analyzers. I need to, uh, yeah, I need to get out of here. I think that is a scav that took a player's stuff. Yeah. No? Is that a player? I'm sorry. That's a player. Okay. Terminator backpack. Oh boy. Oh, I can't. The rest of Bloody Key, you can't do anything with it. That's right. This LS321 thing, I gotta take it off, man. I was gonna put it on to save room, but I, yeah, it's not working. Yeah, that's a player. Right, that was a player. Nothing really doing over here on these shelves, which that's where I've found a uh, found a GPU on the shelves right there before. But uh, CPU. Okay, so I don't have railway, do I? No, I gotta go to power station or Emercom. Which, anyway, I think I was hearing a bunch of shit down here, which is my, one of my least favorite areas to go to. Right. Pray for me, everyone. I'm 
Just gonna, I'm going to tech the tech store, Texo or whatever it's called. Yeah, this is this store right here is the bane of my existence. It seems. All right. What's in here? P plugs, sure. Bulbs, don't need those. CPU, no. Give me one. Give me one power supply and just make me make me really happy. What's this? Oh, Helix. I'm not gonna worry about money now either. I don't really need it. Nothing, just gas analyzers. Okay. Well, here we go. I'm gonna have to get out this way and go through idea, because that's the way out to the other side. So here we go. Oh shit. Yep. See that guy just sitting there waiting for me? This is bullshit, man. I'll tell you what, dude. These scabs are no joke inside of here. I'm, I'm just gonna run across. So I am tired of getting wrecked by the scabs sitting right here. I really am. There's always a scab right here. So, I mean, like, this gun, it jumps up a little bit on you when you shoot it, but, like, honestly, it's been, it's been really good, actually, so far. Do I need that? Oh, I do. Rest base level three. I didn't realize I need those, so I guess I'll take the caps. Okay. Oh, okay. Hello? Anybody home? Okay. Little... Easy GPU, no big deal. An arrested bloody key. I guess that's... I think... Did I have one before and I died with it? I don't remember if I did or not. I think I did. No, actually, you know what? I don't think I ever took it into a raid with me. As a matter of fact, I don't think I did. Okay. I think we need to start figuring a, a way to get out of here. Is this that back room with the computers? No. It's one of the back rooms, but the computer room is right there. Okay. Do I need that? No. Okay. There is the computers. There's more, I think, out in the front. But, uh, yeah. Not gonna worry about it. Dude, PCBs. I got a ton of them. If only I needed PCBs for a quest. Which I don't, of course. Yeah, there's a couple things I can drop like this. Another hammer. Jeez. You know what, I might actually take it too because I actually love that site. Hammer is one of my favorites. Because you can it already it already has like a red dot integrated into it. There we go. Uh, too bad I can't put it on something. Not worth it. Alright. Back to what I was doing here. Okay. Where was I? Um. Okay. Yeah, I went back through here. Let's go this way. Back to the back of Ollie. There's, a, I think there's a bank of computers in Ollie too, isn't there? Ooh. There we go. We got one. Was the freaking zipper? I was like, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, is this the back where the? No, that's the stairs. Okay, there's two crates here actually though. Yeah, there's certain things I will drop if I find something I actually need. Level three, yeah, it is. Okay, I'm keeping level four. Do I need that six B for something? I need it for a quest item, but 
That's fine. I don't I don't have that quest yet, I don't think. Um, where's that bank of computers at that I'm thinking of? Is it it's not back here, no. I don't know. I might have missed it. Is it this door here? No. You know what? This just goes to the back of the store, which is fine. That's actually where I need to go right now. Need to get out the back. Hopefully, get out the back. We'll see. We'll see if the game wants to be nice to me. Probably not. This game is never nice to me. Um, oh, it's a motor. Do I need motors? I think I do, actually, right? Yeah, I do. Um, what do I not need? What do I not need? Yeah, Sanalyzer. I don't actually need that. Dude, let's get out of here. This is actually a super lucrative run. And every time I say that, what happens is I get I get just bombarded by scabs. Okay. Every time I'm like, oh wow, this is a great run. Nope. Scabs are like, I don't think so, scooter. You think you're getting out with all this loot? Yeah, right. Okay. Isn't the, the way out over here? No? Isn't there a way out back here? Am I remembering this wrong? No, it's back. It's back over here, right? I don't know. Dead body. Probably a dead scab, hopefully. You know what, the computer's actually, now that I think about it, it might be back there, but. Do I have an SJ6? No. You know what, actually though, I might just pop an adrenaline. There we go. Now we're high. Now we can definitely make it. All right. Oh, Emmercom. There we go. Perfect. All right. Let's check our way out for stragglers. I have Emmercom, right? Yes, I do. Somebody killed a scab right there. It's a pilgrim. care what the scav has. I just need to get out of here. Okay, let's go. Okay. I'm to use this adrenaline burst. Hopefully to run over here. Adrenaline's wearing off already. Jesus. That was quick. I think whatever came through here probably came over here and extracted too. So. Unless we have ourselves a camper. Please no. Please no, because this was a very lucrative raid. Oh my god. Okay, if we get out of here, this will make up for all the ones we died. For sure. Nice. What a raid. What a raid. Okay. Not only did we get a lot of scav kills, we, yeah, we did kill a couple of players too, but one, two, three, four, five. So I think we need, what was it, five more for 25? So I think we were at 15, so we need five more. No. No. We need 10 more? No. I think we need five more. I can't math. Anyway. Nice raid. All right, everybody, what a lucrative raid. Okay, so the reason why that was so lucrative was not only because, I mean, we came out with another rusted key, which is great for this uh, a certain quest in streets, 
Now we got two of them, so we got two tries at that in case we die, which probably will happen eventually. Um, we got a bunch of we got a, we got a bunch of stuff we actually need for the hideout. Uh, we got a motor, which is needed. We got a PSU, which you need a few of those. We got a GPU, which I can honestly, uh, I'm should I keep it at this point or just keep selling them? I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna make the Bitcoin farm or not. So I think yeah. See, like if I was gonna make a Bitcoin farm, I'm I I have stuff for it. But I think what I'm gonna do is I'm probably going to sell it because we need money. We're working towards that stash upgrade, so I'm probably gonna sell that. And I think yeah, I don't need that either. Money. Um. Okay, PCBs. This is a barter trade for a mag a standard 60 round magazine but i don't know what level of peacekeeper do you need i wonder if that's level four peacekeeper though we need this remember that because i died with it once already before we need spark plugs 100 percent. so that's good to get yeah cpu fans you can trade them for a an m4a1 maybe i keep those just simply well, i don't really need guns at the moment so we're gonna sell it we need money pliers are good to have but i think i have a set already for crafting yes I do okay so we're gonna get rid of those power cords we need D fuel we're selling it uh, this you actually need for a gunsmith quest but I think I already have it so I'm not gonna keep it I don't think let me see no so I got a quart oh, okay so I got a quars so no I don't have it I, th I don't think the three two one unless it's somewhere else no, okay. I think I kept the wrong one. So the LS321 is the one you need for a quest. Yeah, so okay. Well, cool. Good thing I grabbed that. Um, we'll do that. We'll put this up here because we're gonna need to unload that, put that there, bam. Okay, and then we got two hammers, which what this one doesn't have the thing in it. I guess I can try to put something up there. I don't know. Anyway, I, I love this site. It's like one of my favorite ones. So yeah, that's why I do that. Oh, and then I forgot. We got a Tetris. That's right. Uh, anything else? No, just more rubles. Okay. Cool. So we made money. Uh, oh, a Grizzly too, uh, which I don't need. I can just sell that. Um, and then a USB 45, which we're, we're selling that too. Okay, money. Let's go get our money. Uh, let's see. Who we need to sell stuff to? Well, I guess actually let's do this. Oh my god, these are going for a lot. You're kidding me. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and assume that these are just very expensive in the game right now. Um, so average, 915. Let's see. One just came up that was yeah, nine we're doing 915. It's 54k just to list it. You know what? I, I, uh, I bet you, you know what, I'll just do that. It'll sell quick. It'll sell like two seconds if I do that. Um, do Tetris or, oh my gosh, those are worth, how much are those actually worth? When I sell the therapist, is that worth the same? No, it's actually worth more on the flea. What? Okay. Well, we're selling it for 125. Yeah. Cool. Um, let's see. I think. D fuel maybe is worth a bit. It is. Let's do 35. We're going to make a lot of money here. Okay. Now, let's see. What are PCBs worth? 15K. Yeah, they're not worth a lot. Uh, Grizzly. Yeah, these are usually worth quite a bit. So what I need to do is I need to get my stuff to sell. My God, that's a lot of money. Wow. We're getting close to that that stash upgrade, you guys. We're we're almost there. We just need a couple more a couple more mil. Uh and yeah. Let's see. Um okay. Filter. Let's see, 45. Yeah, let's do 45k. There you go. We're gonna make a, quite a bit of money off all this. Nice. Um, and I think the rest, let's just sell to, like, mechanic or something. Yeah, see, I'm going to have Peacekeeper level 2. I think I need level 3 to be able to get that 60 round mag. Yeah, at least. Pretty sure. So how close am I to that? Oh, all I need is just to get do more quests for him. And then I can do that. Yeah. So maybe I keep these for the barter trade or something. Maybe that's what I get at level 3. You get the barter trade for that mag. 
I need that 60 round mag for a gunsmith quest. Because you can't buy it on the flea. You got to find it. So, yeah. Let's do... Yeah, let's just go to, like, mechanic and sell this stuff. There you go. Let's get rid of that. And then we'll go to therapist, sell this. And we'll keep these. What do, need, what do I need? Uh, you only need two of them, but... Oh, shit. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, what a, what a massive, like... Wow. That's, that's huge. Look at that. We're at six mil now. That is massive. That's absolutely massive. Okay. Um, yeah, nice. Uh, what's next? Let's, oh, let's go to our hideout. I'll show you guys just after that raid. Uh, the good thing about that raid was we got ourselves just that much closer to being able to upgrade the generator. Um, because we've, we got the motors now. Um, we got, we found a, a power supply. So like I could probably buy everything for this, but these are just becoming so expensive that it's like, man, I almost want to just find them because you can't, I can't craft them at the moment. So like the motors were the one expensive thing. I almost got all these. I feel like I can find these and these and even this, these I find all the time. I just never pick them up. So I kind of don't want to buy anything. I kind of just want to find it as we do our raids because I think we can absolutely do that. It's not going to be that hard to do. Um, Rather than spending the money, we kind of need to save the money uh, and get our hideout upgrade. Once we make it to 8.5 mil, then we're upgrading the hideout and we're literally going to have no money. But that's okay. We're going to we're gonna be able to say we did the hideout upgrade finally to level 3. And we we have like what you get with EOD just by buying the EOD edition of this game. <laughs> which is kind of funny. But it took us this long to do that with a standard account. But yeah, it's kind of... So yeah, when you say is EOD pay to win, it's like in that respect, kind of kind of is um oh yeah we killed a person right okay um yeah what a what a what an easy a little easy going raid right there not bad okay so also where are we with our with our raid or our, sorry our t our task yeah we need five more scav kills so um i think what we got to do is we literally just got to go in again and try to kill those last five scavs so i may i may do like the exact same uh, you know, the exact same thing. Go in there, search the same areas, go to that one little area, try to snipe some people from the top. Um, yeah, and do that. Maybe maybe this time, maybe I do bring a bolt action rifle and a, and, a, and a pistol. Should we do that? I think maybe we do and like and get that bolt action skill up because I haven't been doing it. So yeah, it's stuck right here and I need to get that to level three for a different quest. So maybe we, maybe we do a sniper rifle and uh, and bring that in. I don't know. I'll surprise you guys in the next raid. All right, everybody. Interchange with a sniper rifle. Here we go. Let's see how we do. Ooh, there's already a scav right there. Okay, I'm just gonna milk this right here. That was a kind of it's kind of lucky. Let's see if I can get him. Did I get him? I don't know if I hit that shot. Interchange. Um, no, I didn't hit him. Damn, there he is. Are you kidding me? This guy has freaking aimbot at me. Did I miss him again? I gotta get used to this rifle. I yeah, I never use these so. Okay, the object here is I was going to go inside the damn place, but, uh... I'm just going to snipe outside, I guess. Did I, do, did I get it this time? Come on. I hit him. Okay, cool. Alright, so I'm kind of... Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of going to cheese that and use that as my uh, to my advantage just so I can see if I'm actually hitting the scabs or not. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to go inside. Yeah, I want to get it back inside and then get to the third floor. Um, where hopefully I can start sniping again. I'm already hearing some shooting, so... Isn't there a freaking tin stash over here? I don't know. Yeah, I haven't used a sniper rifle in a while, guys, so I might be a little rusty, so... Expect to see some exceptionally high level gameplay here <laughs> I 
Yeah. Yeah, I really need to just get to my, uh, get to my spot that I'm talking about. And, um, yeah. Where's that dead scab at? Just kind of want to tap him for the XP. That's it. Um, where do you run to? It was like over here somewhere, wasn't it? Uh, thought it was like right here. I don't know. Well. Alright. If I can't find him, it's all good. I'll just run inside. And I got my pistol. Um, just in case. So this will be my... This will be my main weapon to use to fight. Close range. So we'll get some, uh, we'll get some pistol kills, maybe. Not that I need them, but... Just for the sake of doing it, why not? Alright, let's go through here. Hopefully we don't have any company here. <clears throat> um, yeah, do I want to go through the back or do I want to go under here and then go in? I think if I go underneath, can't I just get right in and go up? Maybe. We'll see. This could be the wrong idea here. And end up running into killer or something, which could be bad. Um, isn't that the, isn't there a floor that goes right up to the top underneath here? I honestly can't remember, man. I suck at this map so much. You guys have seen. I'm, I'm not the best at interchange, man. It's not my favorite map by any stretch of the imagination. Um, I think I might be on the wrong side. I thought this like goes all the way around though. Is this it right here? Okay, that goes up right there. Yeah, I can I can just use that to get in. Yeah, we'll just do that. That's fine. We'll use this little area right here. So I'm pretty sure this goes up. Oh yeah, actually no. This that goes up to the back of Ollie, right? That's what I'm looking for right there. And that goes up. Okay. Usually scabs hang out right here too, so I need to be careful. L1A1? What the fuck? Okay. I don't know what that goes to. Yeah, here's some shooting. Not reassuring at all, but you know what? Yeah, we're gonna have to just send it, man. Because we need to go up right there. Hopefully I don't come up here and turn the wrong damn corner. Okay. This is a tech store too. Ooh, I need these. Yeah. I need drills. Take those. I need RAM. I need power supplies. Yep. Alright, we're dropping this. So I'm gonna be very heavy. Okay. Drills and power supplies I'll take. Absolutely. Okay, that's to my left over there. Don't need don't need gas analyzers. We find those all the time. I feel like there's a quest coming up where I actually do need those. CPU fans sell, so I'll take that. Okay, so there's... Gosh, there's... Yeah, okay, so I think I can get up right there, can't I? Yeah, pretty sure I can. Do drills, yeah. These, are, these sell for a lot, so I'm gonna take them. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Someone's shooting at me. Uh-oh. Where? Where? Oh, it's a scab. Yikes. I'm caught between two people. Okay, got him. Need to heal. Okay, I don't know 
where this other guy is. Of course, there's a motor right there, too. Okay. This other dude. There he is. There he is. A huge lean right here. I get him. Oh my god, what a shot. Okay. Let's go. Got him. Alright, let's heal our arm. Pretty sure that hit him. <laughs> I'm not like 100% sure, but I think I did. Just heal up real fast and get this arm back so we don't suck at aiming because we're using a sniper rifle, so that's kind of important. And I just want to fully heal my stomach real fast and then I think we're solid for the second. Alright, thank god I brought a pistol, man. That was helpful. Or I would have been freaking, what do you call it? Just sight aiming. Um, I guess I could take his VPO. I don't really want to though. Hopefully I don't need it. Hopefully that's not a bad decision. I, I just... I just don't want to carry extra weight. Yeah, we'll take your meds, though, for sure. And this, in case I need it. Okay. Let's see, dorm 118. T45 M1, I don't need that ammo. Okay. Yeah, that guy's down. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, not a shooter born kill or anything like that. Yeah, motors sell for a lot too, so I'll take that. Thank you very much. Um, okay. We're already insanely heavy. I'm not even gonna go fuck with the scabs right there. Nope. Oh shit. Oh, so I thought I saw somebody's head. Yep, he's definitely down. I'm not even gonna go loot him right now. Just gonna go loot the uh, tech room, tech store here. Um, I gotta consolidate my pistol ammo because I wasted a lot of it there. Okay. In that fight, and I don't know how much I have left. Oh my god, I think we found all of our PSUs. I might just need to get out. Holy shit. Remember all those motors and PSUs I was trying to find? Yeah. Okay, well I already have all the motors, but I can sell these ones. Okay, so where is my extracts? Um, rail, I need railway, or power station, okay. Ram. Well, I was trying to get to the middle over there and do some sniping, but, uh... I think I found all the stuff I need. There's another freaking motor right there. I could have gotten all the motors in one raid. Jesus. Pretty sure... Spark plugs I'll need. Um, I'll take T plugs. I think I'm going to end up needing those pretty soon. You know what? I'll take this other motor. It's going to be heavy as hell. I don't, I don't even have any space. Oh, yeah, I do. God, I'm so heavy. Okay. So before we go snipe, let's, uh, let's consolidate our ammo. And then we can kind of just go out. We can actually go out the front right there. I really don't know how much ammo each one has. One shot. There you go. Um, that 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 settles it. Yeah, let's just consolidate it all into one mag, so I at least have a full mag. Maybe one little extra. Okay. All right. So I got 19 shots in that one. Let's fill this mag up too. Okay. Isn't this the middle part that I always that I was going to? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I need to go over here. Let's see if we can get some sniper kills. And then 
we'll go out this way and go try to get to the railway exfil and then i'll pop a uh, i think i have an sj6 on me or i might even have a trim a doll or something something that'll help me run longer distances okay Let's see if we see anybody out here Will I get lucky like last time? Yep. Bam. There's one. There's definitely more over there too. Okay. Yeah, this will be a an absolute playground for me right now. And the issue will be if they start shooting at me. I gotta move. Where's that other scab? I saw another one. I'm gonna try to get the rest of my scab kills while also getting sniper skill. Okay, do I see anything moving? There was another scab in there for sure. But I think he just backed off. Okay, so my exfil is that way, so I can just go right out and go that way. But, I'd like to cover my exfil if I can. Why am I falling? Okay, what the fuck? The game's like kicking me out of my spot right here. There you go. Okay, so there is another scab in here. There he is. What? Oh. Seriously? Nice behind the wall, of course. What a surprise. Alright, let's see if he pops out and tries to shoot me. I'll take him. So I got that one. He's right there. There he is. How does that not hit him? Did that get him? Well, let's see if he pops out behind the truck right there, because that's where he's trying to go. I think I got him? Unless he's sitting right back there. Uh, let's see. It's a Goosten SJ1. Actually, I don't have anything that I kind of want to take right now. I was going to just take a adrenaline if I had one. Don't see anything moving to my left. Well, of course, I want to do sniper kills, and all I see is like a couple of scavs. It's my front, and I don't hear anybody else. The rest of the map is quiet. Where are all the players at? I think I got him. He must be dead behind that truck. I bet you as soon as I go downstairs and try to exfil, there's going to be a million things out here. There always is. Maybe I just wait a little longer. Oh, here we go. Nope, that's a tree. Yep, that's a tree. Um, anybody running around? That's. I mean, I'm looking mainly for to see if like anybody just runs around the bottom down here. Anybody running around doing quests? Trying to exfil over there. Well, not over there, but you know what I mean. Let's see. Are there any more scabs they are going to shoot at me over here once I get out? There should be a ton of scabs over here. There typically are. Like I said, I bet you a million dollars that like as soon as I go down there, there's going to be a ton of them that want to run at, run at me and shoot at me. But we'll try to make this a quick one. Let's see if we can... Uh, can I just top load it? Oh. That's stupid. Okay. Take my round back. Thank you. Okay. So I got two scabs. How many do I need left? I think I need like one more, don't I? I'm so close. No, two. Two more scabs. That's it. Two more scabs can't just, you know, run in front of my gun real quick. Oh, I bet you a million dollars. Like I said, guys, if I move and I go down there, they'll, be, oh God. Okay. I don't know how anybody hasn't run up here and come behind me before, you know, or yet. I'm not sure how that hasn't happened yet. Okay. Oh, here we go. Got something. Oh man. Okay. There's a scab, but I need to kill him. Come on. Come on, Rick. Did I get him? No, what the f- 
All right, this thing is not zeroed. Got him. Yeah, I got to aim like one mil up from here. Okay, so I need one more scav. That's it. One more scav, and then I'm good to just run out of here. <clears throat> well, you know, hopefully. Hopefully run out of here. We'll see. We'll see if we can get out of the raid. That, that would be the funniest ass thing, too, is if, like, we can't extract, like, someone's camping us over there or something. Which is why I'm doing this. I'm trying to cover my extract and see if we can just make it out without having any resistance. Trying to make sure there's a gun right there, so a dead body must be right there. Okay. I don't see anybody doing anything over that way, though. That's the way I'm going, so. One more scav. Come on. One more scav. Spawn a player scav or something. Because I want long distance shots for my sniper kills, too. For my sniper skill. Last time I had a player, like right over here somewhere. He just kind of ran out on there. And I was like, oh, thanks, buddy. We're playing the waiting game. This is a, this is a boring... I'm sure it's a boring raid for you guys. But I... You know what? Like, sniping like this is like... Is actually kind of fun. In the, uh, in the live version of the game, like, you got... Sometimes you just got to do this. This is the only way you get sniper skill... Sniper kills. The only way you get, like, shooter born in heaven kills. Also, why I was looking to see if any players are running around out here, I could get shooter born kills. I think you can get them on interchange, right? Don't you have to get shooter borns on interchange? Yeah. Yep. Oh, I got one. Oh, I must have got one that last raid. Then that must have been long enough. A long enough shot. I guess it doesn't matter. Is it a bolt action rifle still? Bolt action rifle. When did I do that? Did I kill a player then? Maybe one of those was a player that I killed. Oh, that's a tree. Oh, there very well may not be anything out there anymore. Okay, well. Oh, what time we got? Okay, 20. Let's go ahead and drink this. Alright, and uh, what is it? What is an SJ one again? Strength. It does have a. It does get increase my strength. So. Oh, that was a freaking bird! I saw something go past my screen. I thought it was a player running out there. I was like, "There's my chance." That's my chance. Wait. So if I killed a player, then, wait a minute. Hold on. Huh? Well, that must have been a different raid that I did that. Yeah, I definitely have just been killing scabs this raid because I got I got one more left until I got this quest done. And this is like the area to do it. They should be right here. And I, I want to get out with all this loot, but I also want to finish this quest. We need those power supplies for our hideout upgrade so I don't have to buy them. So that'll be clutch. All right, well, I think maybe we just abort and we try to go out and we'll see if we run into some more scavs and I'm going to have to probably do some more uh, long range shooting, uh, you know, under stress. Yeah, because the raid all of a sudden has gone quiet. So nothing you can do about that. Oh, hello. I bet you a million dollars, guys. I bet you I, I run downstairs and then there's like three scabs running across the, th the way towards me. It's just the way the AI s spawns always work. It really is. Alright, well, nothing really I can do right here, so. You can go downstairs and, uh. Yeah, take our chances down here and see if there's this. I mean, there could be a very well scab right there that wants to take my face off, which. Oh shit. I already hear one. Yep, there we go. There it is. Okay. Quest done. Okay, let's go.
Let's get out of here. go moment of truth here all right we got some some good strength so we're okay so what i'm gonna do to make this easier oh see look, look what i say it's gonna be a million scabs running around i told you guys this one to my left as well i need to go this way like away from them Otherwise, I'm going to get wrecked. One of them's going to lock onto me and freaking kill me before I can get out. Tango down. One tap. Yeah, there was another one over there, too. I could hear him. I think it was a tango down unless he ducked at the last second which they've been known to do scabs are shifty MFers man oh, that was definitely a confirmed tango down yep okay let's go railways right here let's get the hell out of here Is that a body, by the way? I kind of just want to confirm that. Is that a body right here? I saw a random gun right there before, but yeah, I don't know. Okay. Let's go through the trees here. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. This could be the end of me. Yep. You're kidding me, right? Tango down. another heavy bleed med oh shit I do just got to use this use I would have used my ETG if I didn't have one but I don't need to now you black my leg of course and so I gotta sit here and do this I'm telling you guys game was trying to take me out man they don't want me to get out with this stuff cuz I'm slow Alright, we'll use the Propy to get us almost he healed all the way. In those situations, guys, I've learned, especially in SPT, do not stay there and try to fight and peek multiple times. You need to literally just run run back and, uh, what do you call it, re re and try to regroup and shoot from a different angle. That's how I basically just got that guy right there. Otherwise... The scav AI in this game, if you keep peeking the same angle, they will 100% kill you. That's how I died in that first raid in the episode, was I kept peeking the same angle over and over again, and I just stayed there, and that scav obviously made quick work of me. What's he got? Yeah, he was shooting slugs too, I think. Yep. That's why I hurt so bad. Freaking... Yeah, that that really hurt me actually. An L1. I need don't I need that? Oh shit. I need that. Okay, so that's that's big. I think L1 and a mule are the only two I need. I'm glad I freaking checked that guy. I was almost not gonna check him and just run out of here. Let's turn our la I had this laser. I put the laser on there simply so. I could like hip fire somebody if I needed to for that same that, like that situation we were just in right there. Okay, we gotta crawl. Um, but yeah, I haven't had to use it luckily. 
Yeah, that could have been bad. That last scav right there, or that, well, not the last, I'm not going to say the last, because there could very well could be another one over here. I don't see or hear anybody, but, uh, not yet anyway, but you never know. As I always say, every raid in this game, it's not over to, oh, is that a fucking scav right there? Nope, that's a shadow. I swear to God, I thought that was a scav. I was getting ready to take, just, I was literally getting ready to just pull the trigger, just preemptively in case it was. All right. Let's see. We're going to be limping to the extract here. Luckily, we had a propy. Not really. Propitols, I swear to God, man. They're worth, worth their weight in gold in this game. They really are. Propitols are very, very, very good. There's other stims that are like it that do similar effects, but like for the price and how the fact that you can craft them and all that, propitols are amazing. Okay, here we are. Love it. Let's get the hell out of here. This right here will be a huge win. Oh my god, that'll be a huge win. Love it. What a raid. And we're back. We're back, ladies and gentlemen. Huge. Absolutely massive raid right there. Um, oh, I did kill another player. Oh, right, right, right. That was the, uh, right, right. So maybe that was the shooter-born kill because he was so far away. Okay. You guys are probably like, you're probably like, oh, remember that guy you killed? Yeah, okay, got it, got it. Got the one with the Glock and the other one was the M700 that I killed him. Okay, yep. Perfect. Okay, so we did get two players. That's right. That's right. This guy almost got me. Like, you guys are probably, you know, you know, shitting your pants at that point. <laughs> Either way, great raid. Great raid. We got a couple quests done, so let's get in the hideout and check out, check out what we did. All right, guys. So with that raid out of the way and that win out of the way, um, we're in a very, very good position because we just picked up some crazy, crazy valuable loot. Like, these PSUs, these drills, these motors, these motors sell for so much, man. And we're going to need all that for, uh, for, what do you call it? The hideout upgrades and stuff. We're going to need a lot of that stuff. Um, yeah, we got a lot of useful loot right there. That's great. That's for a barter trade we're going to need. Um, we didn't go get that other guy. I didn't even go loot that guy. Man, you guys know why, okay? I'm not even trying to screw with that area of interchange over there. That little, uh, Ollie. I don't know what's going on in Ollie or why, but it's like, whenever I go over there, the scabs over there are just nuts. So I'm just like avoiding it at all costs. It's like I'm, I'm, I'm avoiding it like the plague. Um, okay. So great raid. I'm, I'm super stoked we got out of that one. Um, fairly unscathed. I almost got, I think my armor saved me there. Thank God I got a class five armor on. Cause uh, I think he did. He, well, he actually, no, he shot me in the leg. That's right. He blacked my leg. Oh, how, how do I have all those SJ6s and I have none of them in my <laughs> injector case? I'm an idiot. Uh, L1. Okay, I don't think I had one of those. So let me see. Uh, we have morphine in there already. I have Zagustins in case I need them for bleeds. What should I... A Trimadol, I think, would help me get out of raids faster. So, And I don't need that for samples, so I'm going to take that with me in my uh, in my my case there. And honestly, what does Melodonin do? Oh, it gives me endurance and stamina recovery as well. So maybe I'll just use a, stam a Melodonin as well. Yeah, it, it saps your hydration and energy. That's the only bad part about that one. So maybe Trimadol and Melodonin we'll use in case we need to... Kind of like a mule. we we'll use those in the in the same same way. Um, But yeah, I got plenty of adrenaline and stuff too. Okay, we're in a good spot. We're in a good spot with stuff like that for our, for injectors and, and all that crap. Um, Now, next, let's go to uh, Traders. We completed Ragman's quest. You know what I realized? I didn't I, because we're we're filming this raid. Uh, I took a break after the last raid, you guys, and uh, I have, I didn't film for a couple days. Uh, I had different new dailies, and I probably I probably could have got a daily done just by doing that raid. I forgot to take them, but anyway, love it. Shooting like a sniper. <laughs> how did they? How did he know? <laughs> uh, yep, we got a mark. The, the, those are this. This is an easy one, and then I know all this too. So we can be honestly guys we're like basically back in interchange for a while again um so now oh that's a different quest there um drug trafficking that's lighthouse pets won't need it okay 
I don't know. Yeah, that's all f cigarettes. I didn't find any of that. So actually, no. P eliminate with melee weapons. What a what a quest that is. Good lord. Fleece fabric. Do I have that? No. Elimination. Eliminate. Oh man. Well, now we're behind on that one. Cause I already started eliminating scabs. Anyway, let's go back. Um, what else did I find? Oh yeah. Yeah 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 yeah. We need to go to the hideout. That's right, because we found, I think, I think we have all the power supply units we need now. Maybe, maybe all but one. So let me see. That we need for the generator. Uh, also, I'm out of fuel. I don't know why. I think I left it on for a couple days, and now I don't have any. So, I only need to buy one now. Which I'm okay with. We can buy one. And you know what? We'll buy it with dollars, because we need to save our rubles. So we got all those. Let's buy a couple relays. Uh, realize we need two, right? Okay, and then we need one. So I almost found all this by myself. I'm very proud of myself for that one. So there we go. So now we can upgrade our generator, which we need to unlock basically everything else that's waiting. So there we go. So we'll upgrade that, which that's huge. That is that is absolutely huge. Um, and then after that, I think we can upgrade our rest space, right? Yep, we can upgrade rest space and all and then that kind of everything follows. I think the heating's done. That's right um, What else is and then water collector, right? You need generator as well. So we do this one right after that, too and then from there um, We need to upgrade weapon rack to level two as well. What do we need for that? Shooting range and stash level three. Oh, man What do we need for shooting level two is just a lot of stuff a lot of general loot which we kind of have I can probably just do that for funsies because I got all the, the how much are motors they're probably a lot they are see that's why I like motors I like to find them and I did I, I'm, I found like three in that last raid so if we go back to interchange we can find more so that's fine we'll we'll start looking for all this general loot right here because I have a lot of it already um, that way we don't have to buy it because I got my eyes set on this I really before this playthrough ends and before we uh, stop for the the new update whenever that does come out I really want to accomplish this. I want to get 85 or 8.5 mil, and I want to upgrade to the stash level three, which you get with EOD when you when you purchase the EOD edition. I guess actually you can't do that anymore. Uh, they took it away, but you know back in the day you could do that. Um, but yeah, I already I did. I don't know about you guys. Um, he's just gonna give me a bunch of those. Okay, I need to sell all that stuff to Ragman. Yeah, Ragman, all we need is rep with him, and then we're we're in business. Like, he just, yeah. Um, let's see, mechanic. Therapist. Does that key go for anything? Not really. I mean, I guess I could settle on the flea for extra. No, I, don't, I really don't care, man. Just get rid of it. Um, yeah. Cool. So we're we're doing we're doing exceptionally well. Uh, that last raid, I I'm so glad we got out of that without without getting wrecked there at the end. That would have pissed me off so much. Um, but you know, such as Tarkov, it's uh, load ammo or M80. Um, I do we do it again? Do we like do the same type of thing and go in and? Uh, well, I mean, I need to make sure I have plenty more ammo in these. Ma I need to probably bring bigger mags for the Glock 19. I mean, do I should I should I buy a big stick? I probably should. I should probably put my my first mag should be the big stick, right? I probably should have one of these bigger mags in there. So that way they know I ain't playing around. <laughs> All right. Um but yeah, guys, I think that uh did I I didn't complete anything else, did I? No. I just got that one quest done, which was great. Um, and now Ragman, we need to go back for this to mark stuff and then to do database, which database makes us run around the entire place, which is always fun. You guys know how much I love running around good old interchange, but guys, I think that's going to do it for this one. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end the old episode here because, uh, yeah, we had to start with the, you know, the bit of the other episode that I couldn't really show you guys because I screwed it up and left discord on uh, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that little highlight that I do at the very beginning of this this episode um, you know I thought it was the best way that I could make sure that you guys saw 
you know, or brought you up to speed um, on what we were doing in, in the missed episode. And then, you know, just go right on to this episode and, and continue what we were, we were doing within the playthrough. So anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this one. Make sure you guys like the video if you guys like stuff like this. And if you want to help me out in the best way possible, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel with those notifications on so you don't miss any of my uploads. But until the next episode, I will catch you guys later. See ya.